Well, hello there, YouTube, and welcome to a shockingly warm 56 degree uh, Monday, the 16th of May. Even though it's a very light, misty sprinkle out here, it's very comfortable. Kylie, I think you're going senile on me. I do this every day, and sometimes she looks at me like, what the heck's going on? I come back from the ride on the Himalayan, and I was parking out on the sidewalk there and she come out of the tree farm she must have been going 60 miles an hour going across that field and just whinnying the whole way <clears throat> i don't know what she was all riled up about <laughs> she still got some fire in her that old goat all right let's start off a monday mama it's a uh, a whole lot nicer out here than i expected dr pierce it's howdy Good morning to you all the, all the horses are up today. That was wild the other day. They were all down and the grass got tall. All you see was a bunch of bumps. When they don't have their coats on and stuff, they're all so light colored it you think it's a herd of elk. Look at this. Oh God, I feel that flu bug coming on. Let's call in and go back home. <laughs> wow, it is beautiful though. Holy moly. Once we got down here to Vancouver, it started getting cloudy. Yeah. You wanna see something cool? I don't know if you can see that semi truck, but the entire truck is double stacked with spiders. Yep, there's a spider or two there. Yep, there's an email that came out the other day with a whole list yeah, of them. They were coming. I don't know if all of those are ours, but. Oh, be spider, a... spider building like crazy now. No kidding. Nice. Very cool. That's a lot of speed right there. Mama. A lot of happy people right there. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Cool. All right, Mama. All right. How about it's Monday. Monday yes. fun day. Monday fun day. <laughs> yeah, let's, uh, let's work our way through it. All right. Time All for right. Time. Love you. See you. Bye. I love you. Bye-bye now. Bye. Just bumped into the owner down there. All ten of those are ours. And that's just part of it. Yeah, buddy. Shipping like crazy. God, I love it. Uh, dang, I don't even know what all the bottles are, but who cares? They're all spiders. So how about a 2016 F3 standard? Not only is it a standard, but it's a SM6. Which is kind of rare. It's got a... Uh, brother's exhaust on it. Old, old F3. So did a uh, oil change in a laser alignment. He, he was off a bit. So I've been asked why is this allowed to happen? That's a good question. The, the quick answer is, there ain't no place else to go. The, uh, the places for that are just uh, overwhelmed. So, I don't know. I've heard rumors that a lot of them were sent up here from other places down south. I've even heard as much as they were literally bussed up here, free tickets. Saying, go to Washington, Oregon, they'll take you. I don't know any anything about that. But the answer to why, don't know. Gotta love an F3 standard. I had a, uh, an 81 CB750F. It's beautiful black with a red, and I think, a, I don't think they were both red. I think one was more red and one was more orange. Little pinstripes that ran around it. The CB750F Super Sport. <laughs> but anyway, uh, I had uh, one of the guys bought a, a, a the also a black one which I, I ended up buying one too because I crashed the 81 
because I ended up with an 82. Anyway, it was a it was an 82. Same bike, completely stock, and uh, it wasn't even broken yet. He shouldn't have been running the way he was running it, but you know we're all kids. We don't we ain't got enough sense between the two of us to make up one person. But uh, anyway, repeatedly, repeatedly, his stock bike just dusted me. <laughs> so ended up getting ah, there wasn't jet kits back there, but. I think it was this web, it wasn't a website, it was a catalog, I think it was called Cafe Racer or something like that. They had come up with a, a jet kit so those CV carburetors would work, but it was set up to run uh, um, pod filters on there, so I converted all that and, and uh, it ran better, but still the stock bike was so much more pleasing to ride, oh man. It just, you know, they like a little back pressure. If it's a race bike and you're holding it wide open on a racetrack, that's what this kind of crap's good for. For everyday riding, and they're not jetted right, we can't, we can't do anything with them. If you buy a tuner or something for one of these, you're on your own, we can't touch them. Because as a, as a dealer, that would be a $300 fine. It's 100 grand per incident. And that means per cylinder. And uh, the technician gets, uh, the person that touched it gets 10 grand per instant. I think that price has come way up. This is like going back 15, 20 years. That was the price. I don't know what it is now. We don't care because we don't do that stuff. There's plenty of little private shops that I don't know how to get away with it. We don't care, but go see them. Or better yet, just leave your bike alone. Enjoy the ride. Beautiful. I had no idea it was going to be beautiful like this. Kelly says, yeah, it was supposed to be nice. And I think the rains are coming back tomorrow. Or no, I think she said today and tomorrow is supposed to be nice. So we get to... Uh, Put the 30 cent per gallon increased gas in the old war wagon on the way home tonight. That's pleasing. I was at the uh, birthday party, Eli's birthday party. My little grandsons. Hi. And uh, Ryan goes, So, oh, did you see the gas went up 30 cents a gallon? This morning, I'm like, what? He goes, yep. So at GC's, it is now $5.29 a gallon for regular. I know it's all over the map, everywhere else. And in different countries, you guys are by the liter, and the equivalent is like crazy. I mean, some of you guys like nine bucks a gallon or something, as it would equate to. Whew. So. shield on there man that bracket I mean that's that's pretty heavy duty it looks like you have adjustability from here to the moon on that thing I think I've seen that brand the brackets and stuff look familiar but I think the ones I seen they came up more to the outside you could mount a GPS on that one that's about the right size isn't it somewhere thereabouts about a 7 8 bar somewhere around there them like them ram mount things you can mount them pretty much wherever you want oh we caught it right at school bus time yay so uh, wherever you're at did you guys have a nice Monday? Surprisingly nice here. All the doors are open. I love it when it's that temperature. 
look at this person, how far back they're staying from us. That's a little excessive, but I, I really appreciate it. Nothing like when you look back and you can't even tell what the car is. Because their logo is literally stuffed up your tailpipe. <laughs> uh oh. Oh, he's running. Nothing else? You're less than a block away from a great, big, huge motorcycle shop. Oh, I'm scared these people driving through here. Oh, he's got a bumper thing up front that I had it up in the air doing the oil change and stuff, and I can see where. Uh, <laughs> you know, I call them curb stoppers, and it literally has like this white ashy thing, like he ran it into a curb stop. But not too much. It looks like it was probably just one hit or something. But you had to have Matthew help me because I had to kind of unweight the suspension on front to get it. You know, I slide it over the motorcycle clamps, but they're laying flat. But the bike is so low that it uh, that it hits. Just unload the suspension and it just rolls right on over. But I couldn't be in two places at one time because the back wheel was just past the the arch. <laughs> I guess that's probably why it has that look to it, huh? The leaves are, or flowers are slowly blowing away. But they're blowing away making more of those little trees. Sneaky little things in flowers, aren't they? probably looking up going where's he going taking my little, little loop here in the back corner that's where I'm going uh oh see if I can not scare the little doggy here oh, <laughs> oh look that's so cute who doesn't love I mean who doesn't love a puppy Jeez, how could I forget to tell you? I've just been busy and just never got a chance to tell you. So I got that uh, that green, I forget what it's called, Alpine something, I don't know what it is. So I got rid of the green iPhone 13 Pro Max and the uh, the leather Apple, which is also green, but it's a, called a different green. It's a little darker than the phone. So she don't know nothing about it. So I go, Kelly, come here. She goes, what? And I said, well, when you get a second, come down. So she comes down and uh, I said, you got your box cutter with you? She goes, yep. I said, open up that box. She goes, what is it? I said, just open it up. Oh, man. That's one happy little woman. She needs that old iPhone 7 Plus. And one of the things she does a lot, she takes pictures of birds and stuff when she's sitting out there on the porch. And, um, where is Gay? I don't know if he's going to pick this up tonight or not, but I'll back her in. But she's always trying to zoom with that, with that thing. It don't zoom very well. It's all digital. Everybody, they do their own thing. I realize that. But not for me, man. But I'm sure he loves it. And that's what counts. Don't let some old grumpy fart like, like me tell you no different. Thanks for coming along for the rip. Man, is she as excited as a kid at Christmas? 
She hasn't had a new phone since the iPhone 6 came out. It's her own fault. She won't let me change it. She goes, I like my phone. Do not change it. Do not buy me a phone. It's all right. Well, this time I just did it without asking. Nice little leather case. That's pretty true to the color, actually. Apple does a good job with their their containers. It's crazy how heavy that thing is. That's what's in my hand right now. They're definitely heavy. You gotta roll your belt in an extra loop if you're packing both your phones in your pocket. <laughs> they get heavy. All right. Well, at least they're cheaper than everybody else. 524.9, 544.9, Still, that's the highest I've ever seen in my entire life. That may not be the end of it. <laughs> Hello there, you two. <laughs> I'm coming around to get my hand around her, and I just about... There was thing, a little love tap, tap. Yeah, good thing she's quick, man. That'd have been a solid hit. Yeah, it was one of those. <laughs> I thought she was still standing here. She had stepped back on me. Crazy woman. But I got the front lawn done today. But uh, the dew points dropping. So, I mean, it was like throwing vapor trails on the lawn more. And that grass was getting so heavy, I could hardly lift the bags off and dump them. So uh, we'll tackle. We had to get gas for the mower, gas for the car. and yeah so kind of got a late start got a little late coming out of there too just busy with stuff so both her and i now have our enhanced uh driver's license so we can drive across the border yep so we can we can go into canada mm -hmm. um uh, next on may 3rd of next year they finally have a cutoff date as of that date your regular driver's license you can no longer fly on, on a domestic flight that's yeah. it and uh, you can't drive across into Canada. You can't do that now. Right now, yeah. you have to have an enhanced. I don't know about going into Mexico or anything, but but uh, anyway, you got until May third of next year. So, yeah. or you go to get on an airplane, and you're not going nowhere. Yeah, you have to have it. And it's just there's like chips and stuff inside. Although you don't see nothing. Yeah. There's it's supposed to be some antenna in there and stuff. Oh, God, Secret stuff. Top secrets and spy stuff. That'll get the old conspiracy theory people <laughs> going. I can hear the gears are grinding. Oh, yeah. But um, anyway, uh, so he, uh, so we're good to get into Canada. What was the other thing I was going to say? Hmm. I remember what it was. Oh, still haven't even opened up her iPhone. We're do too yes. busy doing. So we got to get in there and do that. She I needed know. an update. I know better than try to, you know, how you do that quick transfer. You set them next to each other and you're... New phone becomes your old phone, you know, just swaps everything. Got to have both software okay. at the same level. Yeah. I did or that else one they don't year. like to talk to each other. Yeah, it just takes longer. Mm -hmm. Anyway, on that, we'll bounce. Alrighty. Well, thank you guys so much for watching. We really do appreciate it. We will talk to you tomorrow. Same smoke time, same smoke channel. Don't forget to give her a thumbs up. And you guys have an amazing Tuesday or Wednesday. Thank you. We'll see you in the morning. See you then. Tons of spiders at work. Oh, yeah. That's some kind of crazy. They're building them things like crazy. It's going to be good. Oh, yeah. It's going to be a good season. Yes, it is. All right. We'll All see right. you in the morning. Bye-bye. <laughs>